much like a getaway vehicle straight out of a James Bond movie, and its maker's Parajet says it moves like one too. At the recent Farnborough International Air Show, Sky Quad, part all-terrain buggy, part light aircraft, drew envious glances from visitors. On the road, it can hit speeds of up to 115 miles per hour. But when switched into flight mode and fitted with a paraglider, its propeller can power up to 55 miles per hour. Parajet's managing director says it's quite a ride. It's great on the road, it's great off-road, and it's great in the air as well. So I think that was always the concept, was really to have a, a car which you could have a lot of fun with on, on the ground, but then could also take you airborne and take you to new places which you might not have imagined possible. Skyquad began life as a modified off-road buggy, but after proving the concept of a flying car by journeying from the UK to Mali, Parajet designed a production model. It's suited to demanding terrain and sand dunes, but how can the vehicle fly? If you want to fly, uh, you would stop the vehicle, you'd get out briefly, uh, you'd switch the transmission from the wheels to the propeller, uh, and then you'd get your glider out and lie it down on the ground. You'd clip it in here and here, and then get back into the vehicle, drive forward with a, piece of, a bit of force, the glider comes up above you, and then you accelerate forward, and you have, at this point, the toggles for your glider in your hands, a little bit of brakes, and, and you're off. The makers feel there is a niche in the market, such as in the military sector, search and rescue, and anti-poaching, for a vehicle that can cover large areas on the ground and then take to the sky and see things from above.